This land is your, your land. land. This land is my land. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. This is Alan Sean Feinstein, your host for Our Great Kids. Pablo is with us. He has his Feinstein Junior Scholar sweatshirt on. He may not be a junior scholar. Well, in his heart, he's a junior scholar. And I have newsletters with me coming from the schools in our program that are encouraging their students to do good deeds, and do they ever so. I'm going to read you from some of these newsletters. From Bristol, Rockwell Elementary School, congratulations for collecting 700 food items from the East, excuse me, collecting 700 food items for the East Bay Food Pantry. Great boys and girls, and they collect these food cans every year to help the needy in their neighborhood and on top of that they join in my national campaign to fight hunger which comes every year a couple of months later and we're into that campaign right now and the boys and girls in our leadership program in our schools in your schools spearhead that campaign they and their teachers are the backbone of our national campaign to fight hunger that anti-hunger agencies and houses of worship of all stripes participate in every year in every state. Over 1,700 agencies and houses of worship. And I'm so proud of the boys and girls and teachers in our state and near, nearby Massachusetts and Rhode Island that do so much to help me, help others in need. Rockwell Elementary School in Bristol, we are proud of you. If you hear your school mentioned, go in Monday morning and tell the principal and ask if you can tell everyone over the microphone in the office that I mentioned their school. I'm proud of them and I'll be there coming to their school to see them soon. East Providence, Kent Heights Elementary School. They have an annual Crazy Hats Day, and they raised $350 to donate to the Feinstein Charitable Gift Trust, the Feinstein Hunger Fund. And when they did that, I gave them $350 for their school. Rhodes Elementary School in Cranston, this is the school my youngsters, Leela, Ari, and Ricky went to when they were little. And Kenneth Blackman is the principal, and he's supportive of our efforts to feed the needy, as all our school principals are. 650 food items they raised for the Cranston Community Action Program and they put together care packages to send to our soldiers in Afghanistan and they collecti collected money for the disaster in Haiti. Proud of you Rhodes boys and girls. Providence St. Augustine School and they had a goal to collect 500 food items to be given to Mary House. Uh, which is part of St. Patrick's Parish. I was very close to Mary House for many, many years. There was a wonderful, wonderful nun there who was very dear to me, uh, Sister Fran Conway. And I had the honor of making a donation to House of Hope in Warwick. So that facility which sheltered needy families could be named for her, the Fran Conway House of Hope. Love that woman. So, St. Augustine School had a goal of 500 food items. But wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. 
they raised more than 500 food, food items. They raised 573 food items. Way to go, my guys. I love these boys and girls. I'm proud of them. I'll be back with you next week. This land is your land. This land is my land.